So I just want to share something. In case you're a parent and you have kids that play these type of games, I want you to understand something that's very important when it comes to online gaming. First of all, there are stalkers um, in, you know, in the game world. Um, so you'll notice that I put Raven and Casey again. So I'm just going to point this out. Flair down here. I'm having playful banter with uh, somebody that was actually part of my alliance in the past and mean nothing truly by it. We're both having fun back and forth. Flair, this person, she's actually Raven from Kingdom 41, um, where is where I started, but um, was bullied out of that, that, that kingdom. Well, here she is. She has decided to um, <laughs> skip to another um, kingdom. She's crossed servers just to stalk me and she's contacted several people um, throughout the kingdom to try to discredit me and make me look like this villain. Um, she's contacted several of my teammates, um, of my players, and just to kind of give you an idea. Um, so I run this alliance. She's contacted a lot of my R4s and tried to make me look like this uh, person that uses and abuses men. Um, I'll, I'll tell you right now what I did, just to confirm, because I, I'm not, I don't want to ever be a person that doesn't, that isn't willing to look at what the unknown is in regard to myself. So I asked Purple. Now, where is Purple? Doggone it. He's an R1. So I'm going to explain to you how I have my, my kingdom, or my, my group, set up here. First of all, let's get this person out of here. Um, that's actually me. Um, doggone it. But for the most part, um, I asked Purple if he felt that I was using him, because there's not been anybody in my alliance that has donated more resources and time to me to help me upgrade. He's actually donated... Um, the last month of his gameplay to helping me upgrade to level 26. So I want to show you his castle. Um, he's currently, uh, we're currently upgrading him. He's a 20. And let's see, go back. Um, I have him down here as an R1. He's actually one of my R4s. I have him as an R1. These people along the bottom are the individuals that we are upgrading. And um, how we work it is everybody starts at R2. Individuals that donate and that encourage the team and help others grow, they're moved up to R3s. And then from the R3s, we decide who ends up being dropped to an R1, which is our way of saying anybody that's an R1, those are the people we're focusing our upgrades on. Um, so I asked Purple, going back to the bullying thing, I asked Purple, do you feel that I've been um, using you for resources, which <laughs> I, I'm just going to say, I've donated more of my resources than I can count. I spent quite a bit of money on this game. Uh, I'm sorry, kids, if you're listening to this. And um, I've actually donated quite a bit of those resources to my team. Um, I've... I've purchased like the um, the packs to do the um, uh, advanced uh, uh, teleports. Um, so I mean, you know, here's the thing: it, it, it's just ludicrous. This person, um, <laughs> too funny. Um, this person has like absolutely gone out of their way to. Um, you know, cause drama in a totally different server. So if you're a parent of kids, just be aware that your kids may actually have somebody that bullies them, even on a game, even though it's supposed to be fun. Um, this person clearly has nothing better to do with their time than to cross servers and start drama with somebody that couldn't care less that they're even breathing at this point in time, which sounds harsh, but I'm sorry. I left the, the kingdom that I was in before because they were causing drama. Some people feed on drama, and there that person is. Um, so if you're interested in, you know, 
finding this person. They're in Kingdom 41. Their name is Raven. And, um, you know, so look at this. Stalking people across servers. Pretty pathetic.